<laughs> no, I am not racist. Black Lives Matter, damn it! Ow. Catherine Jenner is not a hero. <laughs> not. And we're back. I died, so we had to backtrack a little bit, but uh, right now I'm trying to find a merchant. Mayor Chain. Mayor Chan. Yeah, you're going the right direction. Yeah. Just go towards town. There he is. Hey! What's up, homie? So. Yeah. Yeah, so I would just like sell all the green ones. Okay, not very many green ones. No, I think we already did a purge for those. Don't sell that. Let's see if he's got any better armor, though. Let's see, right now you're on the Silent Hunter one, but... Oh, Emma? You need a bellow back heart to get the upgraded version of that. But it looks like you can get any of the rest of these. The only thing is, like, I always chose Silent Hunter because of the stealth aspect. If I can sneak around fairly easily, it makes it easier for me to just, like, snipe enemies and not have to fight them directly. Yeah, that's true. But you seem to be the more direct approach kind of guy. So maybe that pro Nora Protector Heavy or Nora, or like the, the Arrow Breaker one. Let's see. But yeah, you can sell that shit. Yeah, and sell the ring. Yeah, there's still. Wait, there's still stuff to sell. Up. The, yeah, the ancient stuff. There's another one over to the left. The bracelet looking thing. Or, I'm sorry, Ancient Wreath. Jesus. You have a lot of shit, man. I'd leave it at that. There you go. Clean that my capacity a lot. What the hell have on me? Resist ranged attacks. Hell, you could probably put some fucking stealth things on this and call it good. Or not. Those aren't very good. No. So I don't fucking know. Whatever you think. 15%. Uh, and it's already... Armor designed to... Protect against ranged, ranged. attacks. So... Yeah. Doing a, a melee one is probably a good idea. Yeah. Cover both bases there. Well, all right.
There we go. Meh. You barely ever use your war bow anyway. There we go. I would just, I mean, you pretty much have them all damage. That's what I always try to focus on for the trip, yeah, the trip caster anyway. With like the blast wire and shit. I think it's gonna be OP as shit. <laughs> That's the way I like it. Especially when you go up against those fucking rock breakers. That is going to suck. That's freeze. Oh, I think that's good for now. Yeah. Never end up using the rattler. I don't know. I kind of wonder. We have three different rope casters. Do we? Oh, we do. We need the shadow one. We can sell these. And take those patches off of that one now. That had a, like a 57% handling coil on it. There we go. Replace that one. Up. Oh, there we go. There. Sweet. So yeah, I can do regular damage, electric, and ice. Yeah, I'd, I'd give it a boost to both electric and ice. I'm not using these for anything else, so may, may as, well. as well. Yeah. In case I ever do decide to try out the sh shadow rattler. 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 Okay. So now you can sell those other two rope casters. So. So. Can't sell that. Because, yeah, we never ended up selling the Karja Roadcaster before when Don't I you upgrade them out. that one more time? And you get, like, very rare? Yes. I'm not going to tell you how or why, though, but it will happen within the story. I'll say that much. Ah! So you can't miss it. Okay. Okay, I am doing that totally wrong. Alright, now... We'll fast travel. Again. Well, I got new armor. Means new defenses. No protection. Now I'm covered for range and close range. So, yay! Let's hope this works a little better. So I've never actually used any armor in this game that's actually meant to, like, you know, protect you. Well, except for uh, the super special armor. Yeah, well, that, that one makes you temporarily invincible. To a certain extent. It takes damage, and then, like, if you get too much damage... What the... Okay. Those are those Bellabacks fighting. Right, yeah, okay, I remember. I remember... But yeah, it would like take a certain amount of damage and then like that protection that you get will break and then you can actually take damage and the 
the system needs time to reboot or whatever to give you the protection again. Jesus! This is another cool thing. You can just like sit back and watch machines like kill each other. Except you are getting too close, my friend. You're not watching machines kill each other. You're watching machines kill people. Wait, what? There's people in there getting attacked. Are they? I thought the machines were fighting each other. Well, fuck them. They should never should have wandered in that shit to begin with. And now they see you. Yep, and that's why I'm running. Herbage. Do you need that if what's behind you catches up to you? Something's getting close. Nah, they're losing ground now. You good. Maybe I changed enough focus on me to let those people escape? Probably not. Oh well, it was worth a shot. Bunny! Fatty meat. Oh yeah. Bunny, that's what's for dinner tonight. Save these for the trail. You know, I haven't had rabbit in a very long time. I don't even remember what it tastes like. Yeah, I haven't had it in a while either. I remember having it as a little kid and I I I was not very impressed. Yeah, let's not get killed by the chargers this time. Oh, hey, look, chargers. Oh, there's so many different machine sites over this way. Because you touch yourself at night. Um, uh, assuming. Well, he doesn't want anything to do with you. Uh, one guy's charging you. Just need to do the five D's of dodgeball. I don't remember. And dodge, dip, duck, dive, dodge. Right. I'm pretty sure those are the five D's. I know Dodge was in there twice. Yeah. I remember that much, but I couldn't tell you the rest. But Yeah, because when he's saying that, the one guy's like... You said Dodge twice. <laughs> yeah, that this movie was twice dumb. As important. It was funny, though. It had its moments. Like, I'm, like I really like the parts where Ben Stiller's character is fucking hitting on that lady oh yeah and she's like so time? fucking grossed out by him which is hilarious because they're married in real life maybe she went back then. All right. what now? Huh. take a seat at the campfire and rest Hey! I had already intended on doing that before you told me. How nice of you to finally drop by. Our purpose this night is to crash the focus network. Yeah, tell me the part I don't know. How? For starters, you need to infiltrate the Eclipse's main base. What? That's right. Fortunately for you, I brought you around to the back way. It's right through that crevice. Once you reach the base, you'll see the objective. A derelict tall neck that's been extensively modified. Climb the tall neck. Grafted into the top of its disk, you'll find a module of sorts. Destroy that, and the focus network will crash. So you were part of the Eclipse? I've never been part of anything. I serve my own interests always. But... It is the case that I assisted the Eclipse before I sensed the threat they might become. It was a mistake. 
the that truth comes out. To correct. What sort of assistance did you give them? Head through that crevice, Aloy. You have more important things to do than ask questions. Kind of understand both of them in that case. It's like, dude, what the fuck did you do? But at the same time, he's like, we got shit to do, bitch. We'll do we'll do this shit later. <laughs> 